cousins and I'll be honest um, I fear what happens when I lay are you quite done? sorry Leigh is not happy that I told her she had to sit in the room with me or else she'll bark yeah I fear what I'm going to see when I enter my island like I think it has probably been about a year since I played it maybe it's been longer I really don't know also ignore the ungodly amount of pick rolls that's happening like last night I just felt like playing pick rolls and I realized there's like a million versions of them so I downloaded the um a bunch of trials and I was playing them and I own these two but I've completely played them to death so oh gosh here we go genuinely nervous oh my goodness is, is everyone gonna be gone I think at least one person will have moved and I think that my island will be a weed infested mess but I also think it's kind of fun to pick up the weeds maybe I'm crazy there's definitely a point where there's so many it's maybe not fun and I may have passed that point just realized I don't have any headphones on so I can't hear Isabel so delightful <laughs> of Animal Crossing characters. My goodness, we're taking a while to load. What is happening? <laughs> Let me just drink my coffee while I wait. I took a sip and just immediately made me golf. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I see Fuchsia is still here. Not who I really wanted to see right off the bat, I'll be honest. I want. Where's my Goldie? Is she alright? Is she safe? Um, and this is obviously in the main plaza, so I can't really see weeds, you know, and whatnot. But there's my little flag. My town is called Magia. And I like how it lets you do characters really well. Look how cute they look. Um, you know, I gotta tell you guys something. I was hoping Fuge would walk around a bit while, while I say this, but did you guys know that you can just get a can of whipped cream and you should put whipped cream in your coffee whenever you want like it's not illegal or anything guys you can just do it you can live every day like your own home is a starbucks and i just i want to give you guys permission you can do that you deserve some whipped cream in your coffee let me tell you i find an excuse to do this like every day i'm like it's monday monday deserves whipped cream in my coffee and then tuesday i'll be like i worked really hard yesterday i deserve whipped cream in my coffee and then on wednesday i'm like it's the middle of the week i deserve some whipped cream in my coffee and then thursday maybe i struggle to find an excuse for it but then friday it's like it's almost the weekend i can put whipped cream in my coffee <laughs> oh and i wonder why i have an addiction to sugar <gasps> hello my dear cutie. I absolutely love Isabel. She's one of the best, like, introductions to the game from. Oh, this will never cease to annoy me that when I put in my name, I accidentally put a space after the A, and so there, there lives a permanent space. Uh, so yeah, today, it is it is Wednesday, so, you know, I deserve some whipped cream in my coffee, and it's, uh, that's currently May 10th. Tears of the Kingdom is about to come out. Hasn't come out yet for me. But I'm excited. Oh, we're touching on a seasonal topic. Okay. Oh. Bamboo. That sounds great. It's bamboo season, but my favorite is cherry blossom season. I think it, that's just passed. What is that like in... February, March, I see, well, let's say the game came out in, like, February, and I remember the cherry blossoms were, like, not long after, right? I'm trying to remember. I can't believe it's been three years. Oh, dear, the bedhead. Wait, I'm wearing a Christmas outfit. Wait, I thought she would tell me how long it's been. Then they normally tell you. Okay, I'm gonna check my mail. Oh, it's been so long, I literally forgot how to play this game. Oh, what on earth? Did you see that? I just literally put, pressed the exact same button, like the dingus that I am. Oh boy, okay, okay, okay. Alright, I got a really bad rank, obviously, because there's roaches. Disgusting. Oh, look at that interest. Nice. I got a birthday, um, a birthday card. celebrated Goldie's birthday with her, but I didn't get a single letter saying 
these channels for Animal Crossing and it made me wonder like are people still playing Animal Crossing or or what? I don't know. So this is my I guess actually because I have so many flowers that there might not be as many weeds as I feared. So this is Goldie's house. I made his neighbors, obviously. Oh, Gulliver's here. So, um, just curious though, like, why did, why does she not comment on how long it's been? In the games they used to tell you. Also, I don't know what I was doing there. Don't even ask. I have zero clue what I was doing. Like, I'm gonna remember. Also, I see, like, no... Uh-oh, she's thinking about moving, I think. Oh, I don't really know what to do because, uh, I don't think she was, like, one of my absolute favorite. Why are there... I don't see any weeds. Wait, is there one? No, that's a branch. I'm almost mad. I wanted to pick some weeds. Where is Gulliver? Yeah, I, wow, for playing this is bringing back so many early quarantine memories. I don't know about you. Okay, here's some ways, but I actually love the way these look. And I, I love how overgrown this looks here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's gonna be the last one. It's gonna be the absolute last one. Wait, what? Do I not have a- oh, wait, I don't have a- Oh, I didn't even open these, uh, uh, okay, I- Things I forgot to do. I forgot to put my, my presents. I forgot- oh, she made me a cake. I forgot to. Let's turn that on. Get the thing for the front. Oh, it's actually very cute. I totally forgot to grab the thing. Hold on. I can, like- bolts across, right? Oh, that kind of hurt my plan. Let me see if I can, like, how do you make stuff in this game? I don't remember. Can I just buy it? <laughs> can I just buy it? I'm lazy. You remember when this game came out and everyone was freaking out about the situation in the world, but it was, like, such a solace for us to, um, to sit back and play Animal Crossing, like, is something exciting to do every day, and, wow, now those feelings. So, okay, you had to make a flimsy shovel, and then you had to make a, and then you do that. So, what, you need, like, hardwood? I'm pretty sure I have some in my, how do you open your inventory out? Oh, what? I just turned the light on. Oh, there we go. Okay, so, um, I've got a bunch of boba tea for some reason in here, uh, oh my gosh, this is, um, uh, this is something else. Wow, okay, uh, yeah, let's craft something. Okay, it was hardwood, I craft it, and then you do this cute little thing. <laughs> And then I turn it into, I mean, if you want to get the most uses out of something, you use the flimsy shovel a bit and then you turn it into that, but I don't mind. It's actually fine. Um, all done for now. I think in the end, I didn't love the crafting. I think that I just, in most games, I don't enjoy crafting in most games. Yeah. And then where's the thing? This is what I put. It's a ball print or a plate. That's usually what I put. Shall I look at the, um, where do I have room to look at the thing that I've been given? Um, okay. Just, like, turn around here. Let's see. What is this? Oh, my. Okay. I got a double-sided wall clock. I don't like it. I do not care for it. Um, but I also got cake. 
is adorable. Uh, I just, I don't think I have room in here. I don't think there's room in my kitchen. I have my steamer basket on the, on there, and then, you know, I'm making room for, like, my coffee and all that. Really, I need, like, a table here. And then I would put, for some reason, my coffee beans. You can actually eat the cake. I don't want to eat it. I want to have my cake and eat it too. Okay, uh, back outside and I'll put the, um, door plate on. So, yeah, I would love to know my question for you all to think about. And if you want to write in the comments, is how has your life changed since this game came out? Um, uh, mine changed uh, for the better the worse, for the better, for the worse, it, yeah, I don't know how many people can relate to that, it feeling like, um, yeah, things, it's been three years, and, um, a lot can happen in three years, right? My fossil collection in the museum is done, so, at this point, I'm just selling them, you know? So, um, Let's see, back in 2020, I was 24, yeah, mid-20s, just, uh, feeling a little lost. I had been teaching for a couple years, um, but was starting to think that I wasn't sure I wanted to be a teacher anymore. It was really cute here. I really like what I was doing. Uh, what was the house is this again? I did like a cool little bridge thing for them. If I seem to recall, this is one of my newest people. A dwell. Okay. What is that over there? Is it part of the mushroom? It's part of the mushroom. Huh? So, um, oh, didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I was starting to well, I'd always been posting my videos, you know, but I started posting like more and more. This is Toby's house. And I, uh, here he is. I'm just gonna ignore him for a second. Oh, 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 there's a thing. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, shoot, shoot. How do you look up? I am gonna lose this because I can't- Oh, there it is. Oh, gosh, it's going up. Okay, I- Oh, no, I- Jason, I keep losing track of what I'm talking about and what I'm doing. Uh, don't run through the flowers. Don't run through the flowers. I think if I go back up here, I can catch it. Come on, come on, come on. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Okay, I was way off. Oh my gosh, it's, it's in her yard now. If I just wait, it'll go past. Hey, Leia. Leia, those are my slippers. Leia, those are my slippers. Put them down. Leia always is picking up my slippers and my socks and all that that I wear around the house. And she very kindly uh, redistributes them. That was awful, by the way, to another part of the house. Thank you so much, Leia. I really don't appreciate it. She has now moved them under the desk. Awesome, I did not want that. Thank you. I, um, in, um, in late 2019, I said it was a New Year's trip. Hello, Leia. She put a little head in my lap, so cute. I went on a trip to the UK with a few of my best friends and uh, a couple of videos that I uh, had set to post while I was gone, you know. Whenever I go on a trip or something, I always try to, well, at that time, actually, I didn't have a set schedule, so I was actually, I only had like one video a week, I'm pretty sure. I don't want this. Leia, I'm in a rolly chair and she's rolling me around. I, oh, look, the bug. Leia, stop. I, I'm completely turned in a different direction because she keeps pushing my chair. Leia, stop. Leia, stop. Leia. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Animal Crossing and in real life and in the game, this animal's crossing. I, that doesn't make any sense, but... <laughs> yeah, so one of those videos that 
news and I was really excited so I was like wow when I get back from the UK maybe I should try to like set a schedule or something I'm gonna try fishing I haven't fished in so long okay here we go it just looked like a big fish so oh I forgot how stressful fishing is in this game <laughs> Okay, I should have known. I should have known. The most disappointing thing. What? Oh. Huh. Okay, it's new. To me. Alright, let's go wait this guy up. Wait, no. Let's fish one more time. It's gonna be another sea bass. I just know it. I see that shape. And I used to know which shape was the sea bass shape. But I get excited when I see the bigger fish because it could more likely be something really cool. Um, Ocean managed to escape. I hope she doesn't bark. Oh gosh, okay, well now I can really make a sea bass pie. So, yeah, um, I finally said in early, early 2020, I mean like beginning of January, a three days a week schedule to stay Thursday, Saturday, and I've stuck with that schedule every day except one day a few weeks ago. Uh, there was like an issue and I had to postpone my video a day. Other than that, <laughs> um, I posted and I watched my subscribers go up and up. And at this point, you know, stuff was, was brewing around the world. So I was thinking about maybe quitting teaching because it, it wasn't feeling safe anymore and just trying to do YouTube. So, I did, yeah. So that's how my 2020 started. And the next year, I did another trip. We thought that the world would be fine by then. Spoiler alert, the world was not fine a year later. <laughs> and um, I did a little trip my friends to uh, Iceland and when I got back I bought a house and this was apparently the uh, last time I played was the December before I went to Iceland I think I think so that would have been late 2021 it's not really it it doesn't feel long enough you know but I think it's been about that long. Probably whenever I filmed a video last, because I'm pretty sure that little Christmas outfit was what I was wearing in a video I made. Okay, so this was one of my OG villagers. No, not Annabelle. I'll add, actually, Annabelle's pretty early. Did Plucky move out, actually? Plucky was one of my, my OGs. I'm not gonna lie, I don't remember who Eugene is. I feel awful for saying that, I'm so sorry. Here's my like main plaza area and I was trying to do an American flag and an English flag for me and my husband. Cause he's got a house here and I was trying to do a blue rose to go there. But man, it's so hard to get a blue rose and I was, I was doing a lot of like cross reading here, um, that was the last thing I was really doing. As you can see, I like the flowers. And he's, he is actually one of my OGs. Teddy and Plucky, and yeah, I think if I recall now, Plucky did move out, and I was a little sad about that. Alright, let me try to catch this fish. I feel like that was terrible. Are you serious? Okay. You know, also at the beginning of 2020, it was just, how many bats am I gonna catch? It was just me and, and Rob and, um, and Leia, and I decided I wanna catch that bird wing. I decided in 2020 to get a cat, which was Atticus. And, um, oh yeah, Queen Allison just burning. Uh, so it's hard starting this year. 
those of you, you know, who've been watching, you know that I've recently invited two new babies into my home. And um, they are lovely, lovely kitties. In fact, this morning at different points, I don't know, it's like they wake me up throughout the evening, I feel like. And at various points early in the morning, I noticed that both of them at different points had been like sleeping next to my head. Which I thought was really cute. Nice to hear from you, Sable. So I'm gonna go see what's for sale with my 86,000 bells. Probably nothing new, to be honest. You know, at this point, again, I've really reached a limit of... I feel like I've gotten everything I've wanted to get. I've upgraded my house as much as I want. I've got... Well, I don't... I haven't got all the fish in the books, I believe. But I have gotten all the fossils. I think I'm fairly close to the fish in the books. The thing that I wasn't close at all with was the artwork. Red's. Red stuff. Because red was just, like, really hard to get hold of for some reason. And, uh, let's go see what's for sale and sell my fish. Fish. So, yeah, as you can see, my, yeah, my last three years. Oh, that's Eugene. Okay, he's interesting. It's been, like, ups and downs. Um, overall, I'd say more ups than downs, but some pretty lows. Pretty serious lows. Um, so, I hope that yours has been better than mine. I hope that you've had a, you know, a decent last three years and that no matter what happened in the last three years, I hope that right now you're doing good. Yeah, I really hope so. Um, oh, I totally forgot about this phone thing. How do I look at it? How do I look at this phone thing? I literally don't remember. What? Nope. Plus, is it not plus? What? I'm so confused right now. I thought it was plus. Nope. Nope. Oh, okay, that was it. It was Z L uh Nook Miles. Oh yeah, I remember that it was really fun to take pictures with your friends and such. Oh yeah, that's another thing, me and my friends, you know, we can see each other, so we would So see, look at this, 20, I'll say 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 21. So I guess I played for like two years. What is this one? I can't really failed at this one. Um, did, the, did all of those, but obviously I haven't caught all the bugs. Oh, look at that, I'm two away. That's quite frustrating. How about this one? Nine, missing nine from the, uh, the underwater things about the fish though. Just eight. Okay. So I am really close. I don't, what even is that? I got something cooking related, I guess, which I didn't really do much. I guess the weeds are not how I remember them to be. I'm th I must be thinking of the previous games in which you had to pluck the weeds. See, I've upgraded my house. I don't know what that is. And then there was one that was like, um, play every day or something. What, what was it? Oh, my first birthday that I celebrated there. There's so many of these, my goodness, active island resident. So I played up to a hundred and fifty, I guess, days in a row. Or maybe a hundred. I can't tell which one is. Uh, and after that, I felt like, I don't know, I felt like I didn't need to play as much. <laughs> and that was the point at which I stopped playing, like, every day, you know, logging in, talking to everybody, and doing everything. And at that point, there wasn't as much of a reason to play. So. Okay, he's gonna comment on it. I like him. How long 
things, Ben. Are you gonna tell me? Are you gonna tell me, please? Oh, I really want them to tell me how long it's been. They used to say in the old games. What are you thinking about? <sighs> I'm gonna, I feel bad saying no, but I just too busy for that and I can't make plans for a future day because I'm probably not gonna play Let's Be Real. <laughs> Yeah, so Teddy's house is here, which is where it originally was, and it just never got moved. Here's my museum, I'll go in later. There was an original plan with these flowers, but then they've just kind of grown wild. It's my husband's house, which for some reason he put like right here on this rock. I'll never understand. I think he just needs to move it over a bit to be more like by the beach. And then his bestest friend, his favorite villager, lives here. I think he's in right now. This is Marcel. And I think Marcel's birthday is the last day of the year, which is pretty cool. He's just this little French mime dog. <laughs> there you go. It's been a year and four months. I was right. Oh my gosh. Can you believe it? Oh, it's so good to see you too, Marcel. Oh, oh, it's so cute. Yeah, I like him. I think he's the lazy personality type. They eat a lot, and yeah, they're like my favorite. I do miss how savage the villagers used to be. Kids said to the right side of my island. I'll, I'll take this up, why not? They used to be brutal. And then it was kind of fun. It was kind of rewarding because then they would slowly warm you over time. I'm not going to plant anything there. And that was kind of cool, you know. Here's my orchard. Which is kind of hard to see, to be honest. Oh. Um, I remember I posted when I first started and the game was, you know, new and fresh and all that. Uh, I do remember. There we go. I kind of forgot I was supposed to be looking for these. I posted a little island tour video, and I remember a lot of people liked that and watched it. And, uh, you know, Animal Crossing ASMR was a really new idea at the time. But I had previously tried to film, um, I had tried to film some, but I didn't have a capture card, and of course my previous Animal Crossing game was for the 3DS, so I, I literally just had to stick my camera over my 3DS to film that. It was kind of funny. Uh, let's see if there's anything at this rock, although I don't remember this rock, it might be a fake rock. Apparently not. I don't want this stuff. <laughs> and then of course I always have to, you know, fill in the holes. It just bugs me. Okay, this is, um, shoot, what is her name? Maggie. What? It was Maggie. <laughs> oh, I'll be real. I don't really remember you. You must have been a newer edition. <laughs> okay. I want to see a dwell. I got the, um, I bought back when I was playing. I was at Target and they had the Sanrio pack, the Amiibo pack, for like six or seven dollars. And I was like, oh, I have to get that. It's just so cheap. Uh, and so I, oops. I grabbed. Grab that, and you know that lets you invite the special little Sanrio characters. They're so cute. I love them. And so, a dwell, I managed to get to move here. Man, where is my bell rock? Come on, I don't even need the money. But it's about the principle of the bell rock. It's about the fun of smashing the rock and getting the money. I love to do that. I think this is a Chelsea's, 
on Chelsea, what's her name, Fuchsia. Yeah, well, I mean, the house kind of matches her. Her look, it's very pink. Um, where's it dwell? I haven't seen her though. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's one of the, yeah, it's one of those books. I have, I have like all the books, you know, so. I remember people like trying to, you know, visit islands in Australia and all that to get different seasons when it started. And, do you remember all that? Oh, okay, so I don't think this will be it because there's a stone outside, right? So I don't think that this would be the money rock. I'm running out of rocks. I've always been very impressed by the way that people would move their rocks if you, if you break the rock, which you can do by like eating a fruit, then it will pop back up. So people would completely cover, I think it's this will do every single bit of their island or something to force the rock to spawn in a specific location. I just really admired that work ethic. I could never, guys, I could never do that. Oh, it's a big pond fish. Should I catch it? Okay, let's catch it. Let's catch it. Hello, little fish. Oh, that was a good one. up to my ear and like closing my eyes. <laughs> How many of you did that? <laughs> and then um, this is my secret, the secret beach. See, that's the secret beach. And red shows up at your secret beach, I believe. All right, so I'm really running out of rocks. I think there was like one that I didn't hit. It must have been that one, but the only reason I didn't hit it was because there were flowers next to it. I guess that's it though. Unless is there one down? I used to, you know, oh, were you singing? Very nice, very nice. I didn't get to see it well. I haven't seen her. Uh, maybe she was in the museum. Yeah, here's the other one and I'll just kind of move the flowers, how about that? And I will pop them back here. Brilliant. Put my money away so they have plenty of room. And let's get some bells. I remember how furiously I used to spam a, when I used to do this, because you had to do it just right, or you wouldn't get all your money, you know? There was there was a fine art to it. It's definitely gotten easier in this game. Those of you who started playing with New Horizons, I really think you should go back and try to play New Leaf. The graphics are obviously not as good, but they're not bad enough, I think, to... Oh, I don't have enough money. Um... Maybe I should go put some weight in the bank or something. Let's see. Yeah, it's it's a really good game though. And it's not too different from this one though. It would be like a shock. Like, I'm fully aware that uh, people who grew up playing games will often be like, Oh my gosh, you should play this old game. And if you did not grow up with them, it can be really hard to play them. I have had so many people tell me I should play old Zelda games and I've like tried to oh I have a lot of money. <laughs> um say oh, so she sounds to me. Um I like old Mario games, you know, they're like, oh my gosh, you would love Mario 64 if you liked Super Mario Odyssey and I have tried to play it and I just don't enjoy it. Like I just don't enjoy some of these older games just because I didn't grow up with the controls. I didn't, I'm not used to it. It's awkward, you know, it's clunky and this is nothing against the people who did grow up playing them. It, you just had a different experience from me, you know what I mean? So it's, it's hard because I, uh, yeah, I've played older games like Sims 2 and Sims 3 and 
I would totally be like, oh my gosh, you haven't played Sims 2, you should. But I'm well aware that it might be a nightmare to play. It might be really hard and ugly and just awkward. Because I recently have played Sims 2 and 3 and... Yeah, um, I'm going to the roost, I'm getting some coffee. So like, I think that we view old games of roast tinted glasses a lot of the time, you know? We yearn for the old days, the nostalgic days. Uh, but when we go back and try to play them, gosh, it's not quite the same. <laughs> it, it's, it's not as good, yeah, unfortunately. Sims 3 was really hard to play. This is my favorite spot in this entire game. It used to be in the aquarium, but I have always found Brewster's shop to be the most cozy thing ever. Now, um, Brewster's always been one of my absolute favorite characters, too. The way he slowly warms up to you. And the music is so lovely. So I'm gonna get a cup. But my green kind of matches the aesthetic. Oh, were you wondering when you'd see me today? Or you were you wondering when you'd ever see me again? <laughs> uh, I absolutely want a cup. And I'm gonna sip my IRL coffee while he does this. My coffee is not 176 degrees, mine is actually cold. <laughs> it was hot when I started this video. It is hot no longer. Favorite thing to do in New 
so much in the previous games that when I first saw a glimpse of what the New Horizons museum looked like, I was just absolutely flabbergasted. Like, I just, uh, love it so much, and I may have qualms with the game. Like, sure, I do have qualms with this game, but the museum is not one of them. Although this always, I think this is funny, the little ants that are crawling out of the corner of the exhibit, and where are they going? They're going to the coffee, they're going to the sugar that someone left out, and that gross. I feel like there's supposed to be a book in this bottom thing. Okay, mosquito flea, paper cut butterfly fly. Maybe not. I should really try to figure it out and then get the things and just complete the museum. Although, in real life. I adore aquariums. Best one I've been to 
honestly, it's so abysmal to look at. There's like three things in the entire place. It's just... I would not pay to go to that art gallery, let me tell you. So, honestly, my island, not 
not as bad as I remember it being. Like, I, I remember always feeling very, like, frustrated by, it was difficult to make it look good. I don't know why I felt that way, but honestly, it looks pretty good, and, um, It's not that bad, yeah. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this little walk around my world, my little, my little island, Maja. Um, hold on, do you see what she's thinking about? Oh, yeah, okay. Alright, like, sorry, we'll just go to Goldie's house, apparently. I was trying to say goodbye. Okay, I will say goodbye though. Um, oh my gosh, Goldie, your house is so boring. Girl, we need to give this house a makeover. It is boring. Yes. Yes, I was playing last night. My, it's not an upright piano, but I was playing mine. Sound like I'm playing. I was trying to play, you know, this, but there's only so much you can do. No, I didn't know I could actually do that. I wasn't trying to be rude. Oh, that's really rude. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, Goldie, it's so rude. I'm just gonna lie down on your bed. Okay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, like, at this point, you can, like, offer to buy stuff from them, but I don't want any of your terrible block furniture. Um, well, it's not that it's not fun, it's just that your place is so wooden. It's very wooden. Okay, I'm gonna go. I hope that I don't hurt her feelings, but I have to go. I, I have to end this video. Sorry. Okay, she, Goldie is gonna hold me hostage in this house, you guys. Like, for real. I, Goldie, I'm sorry. She is literally holding me hostage. Oh my gosh. I, we, what, we can play games. What is that? Oh, okay. Alright, everyone, we're playing a game. Okay. Uh, the first card is a five. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it, right in the middle, kind of hard to say, right? I'll say, uh, like, higher. I, this is really just, okay, well, when, what happens now? Okay, that was great. Goldie, that was really riveting. Okay. What? She's gonna give me a, oh my gosh, she gave me a kick it, Balsa. Alright, Goldie, you sweetie pie. You're very cute in your little dress. I like her because she reminds me of Leia. <laughs> Leia's a little golden and, you know, she's my main girl. She's my, she's my, my lovely, lovely little girl. I wonder if there are any cats that look like Marzipan or Peregrine. Alright, so, uh, for real, this is goodbye. <laughs> Hopefully, none of the other villagers grab me and are like, wait, you must come over to my house and play a card game. <laughs> so, I hope you guys have had fun on the island, and um, it actually wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be, you know. I was really concerned for how awful my island would be and people would move out, but yeah, it really wasn't that bad. So, thank you guys for watching, and uh, feel free to leave a comment if you want to answer any of the questions like I asked or talked about, if you want to tell me, like, what you've been up to in the last few years, I would love to know, like, since the game came out, tell me if you still play the game, I'd also like to know. <laughs>
interesting experience. Um, yeah, okay, so that's my recommendation for you. That's my homework. I will leave a link to that video, my Dinkum video, in the description so that you can easily go watch it. And have a lovely rest of your day, everybody. Drink lots of water. Put some whipped cream in your coffee. <laughs> Sleep tight, everyone.